Hello everyone, this is Jose from City of Cars. Today we're going to be doing another walk around video on a pretty cool car in my opinion. It is a 2013 GMC Yukon XL. Gotta love these vehicles, extremely practical cars. Definitely the XL kind of gives you that longer wheelbase, uh, gives you a little bit extra storage room just in case you do need to utilize the third row. Uh, this one uh, has just about 137,000 miles on it, but it is in really, really good condition for the year in the miles. Uh, it has passed our safety inspection. Um, obviously with 137,000 miles, there's a couple little blemishes on the vehicle, but overall pretty nice. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Obviously you got a couple little blemishes throughout the vehicle bumper. A um, couple little nicks here on the front end from highway ships, but really all in all a pretty good condition uh, tires are all in good shape those are fairly new uh, walking around the whole car I mean there's minimal rust that's a thing that surprises me usually at this mileage point usually the doors start kind of rusting off and if you look at this there is minimal rust throughout this entire vehicle I mean if you look at all the door panels this is usually where the corrosion starts here you can see I mean it is it definitely an outlier as far as uh, corrosion goes. It's in really, really good shape. Uh, it does have a hitch package, as you can clearly see. Um, let's go ahead and look underneath here. It does have a power tailgate. Taking a peek here, obviously, being an XL, you actually have plenty of room to put bags or groceries, even if the third row is being utilized. Uh, if we look here, you should have another little storage compartment for extra room. Let's go ahead and take that off. Like I said, just a little extra cubby hole. We'll put that lock back down. Looks like the carpets are going to be in there. Um, hit that power button and the power tailgate is fully working. Um, take a peek here. You got a little loose trim piece. I mean, that is literally uh, double-sided tape that it holds those trim pieces together. But it is on there. Um, and it is good for the time being. It does have aftermarket rims on it, as you can see there. Um, looking throughout the suspension components, let's go ahead and look underneath here at the frame. Again, a little bit of surface rust, but overall pretty good as far as the underbody goes. Uh, let's go ahead and hop right into the interior of it. It does have heated seats, memory seating. Uh, it does, yeah, power folding mirrors. That is going to be on there. This is a four-wheel drive. Go ahead and turn it on you do get two sets of keys and it does have remote start let's go ahead and turn on the car as you can see here Boop. close the door everything's working properly you do actually have pedal adjustments which is pretty cool uh, you do have a heated steering wheel on this vehicle uh, let's see, I think in GMs this is how you kind of go. So exact mileage on this is 137, 136,795. Uh, and just keep it, if it's flashing, that's just the frame rate of the vehicle. Not that the screen's actually blinking here. Um, venting sunroof, that's all working properly. And we can actually retract it back, as you can see. All that's in working condition. Uh, and here you do got a little cubby hole. Looks like you got Soul Surfer, free included with the car, as well as some audio connections. If you look in here, you got the remote for the DVD and your original owner's manual. Uh, let's go ahead and take a peek at the second row seating. Again, all in very good shape. Uh, let's take a peek here as far as, oh, you, you do have that button, which is kind of nice, so that does the operation all automatically to allow you to get into the third row and as you can see all that is in decent shape as well and you do have two dvd sets so it does have the rear dvd entertainment system as you can see here so you got the two screens there once we power that up and put a dvd inside which obviously we can test but it is working mm -hmm. uh taking a peek here obviously nice little panels glass paneling and it looks like those are actually heated so it looks like there's a heating element there but definitely in very good condition especially for 13 grand this is definitely a great bang for the buck as far as a family hauler for the price point um let's go ahead and get back in the vehicle 
and we're gonna put it in drive here and because it's a truck we can probably just go right over this curb here Whoop. no problem with the suspension that's a nice little test right there no rattles or shakes and as you can see well it's letting me know that I don't have my seatbelt on I'll put that on real quick there we go and nice it's comfy ride acceleration's definitely there motor's nice and strong car's alignment look that no no hands on the wheel and it's driving straight no pulsation on the brake pedal so i think it just recently got brakes done so it should be fairly new brakes on the vehicle if you look at the car facts they definitely maintained this vehicle very well if you were to hop on our website and which is www.cityofcars.com you can Click on the Carfax and see it for yourself, but this vehicle was very well maintained by the previous owner. i roll back a little bit, that way you can get a better wider view here. But interior in very good shape. You do get the typical GM rattles, there's like some interior pieces, I'm not going to lie, as you go over some of the bumps, you do kind of get some interior noise as far as rattles, and that's just like the plastic trim piece that's kind of infamous for this generation. But with that being said, looks like the powertrain is solid on this vehicle. Uh, it does have a Bose stereo system. If I zoom in there, you can clearly see that it is a premium sound system on this. Um, it does have a backup camera. I'll be honest with you guys though, if I put it in reverse, you'll see it pop up there. It is based, uh, pretty foggy. We'll do our best to try to clean it up a little bit. It does look like it's fully operational. It's just the lens is a bit foggy. That's about it. Um, does have backup sensors. Um, very nice overall vehicle again for 13 grand good bang for the buck I can tell you the heated steering wheel was on and it is definitely on so um, definitely a nice car overall let's go ahead and shut it off and we'll do one last little walk around on the car here so you can see definitely a nice ride for our, about $13,000 a great family hauler uh, please let me know if you have any questions on this vehicle. Uh, you can, like I said, go on our website at www.cityofcars.com or give me a call directly at 248-892-9663. Thank you so much for your time, guys, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.